Understanding Relief Print, a guide for English language learners. Hello, everyone. Today, we're going to explore the fascinating world of printmaking, specifically focusing on the term relief print. This concept is not just important in the realm of art, but also enriches your English vocabulary. Let's dive in and discover the beauty and intricacy of relief printing. Relief print is a printmaking technique where the image is printed from a raised surface. It involves carving away parts of a flat surface, often made of wood or linoleum, so that the remaining raised areas can transfer ink to paper. This technique is known for its bold and graphic qualities. Relief printing is one of the oldest forms of printmaking, dating back to the 15th century. It was widely used for printing texts and images, particularly in the creation of books and artworks. The most famous example is the Gutenberg Bible, which revolutionized the world of publishing. There are several types of relief prints, each with its unique characteristics. 1. Woodcut. This involves carving an image into a block of wood. 2. Linocut. Similar to woodcut, but uses linoleum, which is softer and easier to carve. 3. Wood engraving, a more detailed and fine technique, using a hard wood block. Creating a relief print involves several steps. 1. Designing the image. First, the artist designs the image. 2. Carving the block. The image is carved into the block, with non-image areas being removed. 3. Inking the block. The raised surface is inked with a roller. 4. Printing. The inked block is pressed onto paper, transferring the image. Relief prints have a significant place in art and culture. They have been used for illustrations, artistic expressions, and cultural storytelling across various cultures. Their distinct style and historical importance make them a fascinating subject for study. We hope this video has given you a clearer understanding of what a relief print is and its importance in both the art world and as an English language term. Keep exploring, and you'll find that language learning can be as creative and exciting as making a beautiful print. See you in our next video.